No shame but mine. I must, forsooth, be forced to give my hand opposed against my heart to a mad brain brute be full of spleen who hath wooed in haste and means to wed at leisure. I told you, I, he's a frantic fool, hiding his bitter jests and blunt behavior, and to be noted for a merry man. He'll woo a thousand, point the day of marriage, make feasts, invite friends, and proclaim the bands, but he never means to wed where he hath wooed. Now must the world point at poor Katharina and say, Lo, there is Mad Petruccio's wife. Did please him come and marry her. Hey, stop crying. You make me cry too. And, and you know what? I'm going to cry too. Okay. Okay, Julia. Your ferret ran away. He did. I know you don't want to believe me, but I know this because, well, I saw him. I could still see it was Fusu, but he was wearing the yellow rain slicker, not the winter coat you tie-dyed for him, so I think he was headed for Seattle. And I don't think we should go after him. Seattle has a lot more to offer Fusu. Food, Drinks, warm shelter, the intellectual stimulation, perpetual contentment. Don't you think he deserves that? You really miss him, don't you? I could be your ferret. Don't dismiss it right away. I, I'd be a good pet. I like to curl up in small places, and I don't mind walks and sticks. You can knit me a winter coat, but you don't have to tie-dye it if you don't want to. That's okay with me. Is that okay with you?